Hello everyone, welcome to Mimo Work Laser Tutorial. Today I will show you how to laser engraft on cylinder objects by using a fiber laser marking machine and the rotary attachment. This video covers the whole operation steps including how to adjust the rotary attachment and how to set up the parameter in the fiber marking software, EasyCAD. We need to turn on our fiber laser marking machine before everything gets started. How to do so? There are three ports on the driver box. Please connect the attached plugs with the correct sockets as shown in the video. This driver box is used to transfer instructions between the rotary attachment and the fiber laser marker digitally. After the cables are connected, let's move to the desk table and turn on the power switch. Gavel head button and the laser beam button one by one. Open the cabinet under the desk and turn on the computer. Now let's click the marking software EasyCAD on the computer. Import the design file. Today we will use our company logo to demonstrate. First, click the starting point button to center the whole design. And we can set the recommended marking speed and power percentage on the right side of the bar menu. Click the logo and we can use the hatch button to fill the gap or lines in the front. Since the rotary is assembled on the side, we need to rotate our design counterclockwise 90 degrees. The marking design will then face the forward direction of the cylinder object. Now click to rotate text mark on the top side menu bar. Press F3 button for the parameter setting. We need to set the step per rotation as 51,200 and enable the rotate axis. Type the part diameter of cylinder object we want to engrave here. For more parameter setting, you can contact our technician. Press this button to confirm and then we are all set. Now let's adjust the rotary and fix your cylinder walk piece. There is a rotating knob on the side of the clamp head. Twist it clockwise to tighten the gripper and twist it counterclockwise to loosen the gripper. Adjust it to fix your cylinder walk piece. After fixing the cup, we can move to the next side of the rotary attachment to adjust the level of the rotating device. Remember, we need to make sure that your workpiece is positioned horizontally so that the distance from the workpiece surface to the gobble laser head is the same. That is constant focal length to every inch. After the rotary attachment is settled, we can move the gobble head up and down to find the correct focal distance as we suggested. The focal length will be different if the equipped field mirror is different. Turn on the red light pointer which can show you the engraving area. Press the F1 button and start the marking. The fiber laser marking machine can perform high speed marking of parts without the use of the ink and dyes. With the rotary attachment, you can engrave on a small object like an engagement ring, crave it with your name or apply serial number, production information, and locks on the big metal workpiece like a flange. Besides metal, many other materials can be engraved with a fiber laser marking machine. Let's take a close look at the actual fiber marking result. For the last step, always remember to turn off the fiber laser marking machine after use every day.